gardening nursery, I guess, to try once again for our landscaping. So let's go. So we want to buy some flowers and some greens. There's some annual. Annual means they die, right? So you're supposed to get oh, we want perennials. perennials. Yeah, yeah. They have peppers. This reminds me of Korea. We always have to find something that is not too big, not too small, and something that doesn't die. Maybe we can put this in on the other side. Wow. So once Jesus told a parable about about um, seeds and dirt, so, so and it goes like this. So Jesus is a a farmer went out to sow seeds and he planted the seeds in the past so the birds came and ate it and then then he planted seeds among rocks but there was no root so seeds sprang up and died because of the heat and then the farmer planted seeds in thorns and then the, the seeds grew but then they were choked out because of the thorns and then the farmer planted the seeds no, in the dirt. Oh. And the seeds grow threefold, sevenfold, tenfold, and a hundredfold. I mean, you know, change the ten to fifteen. I mean, like a, it's like a lever. Mm hmm. upper room worship they were talking a lot about Israel's return and you know as you know we are going through a lot of things so I didn't feel like I didn't feel like it was our season to be there and pray for Israel when we are already going through a lot God told me the Holy Spirit told me pray for Israel I didn't go up in the front but I still prayed and God did tell me that you take care of my child and I take care of you God did tell me you pray for Israel, you pray for my child, yeah. my children, I take I care of I believe that children. is biblical. Silas is healed. So yeah, I pray to my Amen. Yes. I want to read up on it, study more about it now, because now I experience it in my life that I prayed for Israel and got it a week after that. It might have been Tuesday too, exactly like before Silas was healed. Amen. Interesting.